I think it's so important, especially to do here, um, to show unity um, among like the people that are happening in our continent. Um, this isn't a political issue. This is a humanitarian issue. Um, justice for other people should not be something that's debatable. And if we see that other people are facing injustice within our society, I think it's really important for us to speak out against it. We are here as Kanakamali to stand with you, to stand with all of our brothers and sisters who face the same oppression, who face the same violence, who face the same type of discrimination every single day. We're here to celebrate. We're here to call out and give names to the voices who are lost, to the air, the breath, that which sustains us all. We fight, we love, we sing, we dance. We have critical conversations with one another. Because this is the revolution. This is the holy. This is what we have been working for all of our lives. I'm here with my family, my husband, and my two grandsons. Uh, they're dressed out in their powwow dance clothes. Uh, my two grandsons are half black uh, and they both were asking what we can do to show solidarity with all of our black relatives uh, here on Oahu and on Turtle Island. So we're here to participate in the march and show our solidarity. We have nothing to lose but our chains. We have nothing to lose but our chains. We will love and support. down here to let people know that black lives matter doesn't mean that all lives don't matter. What it means is that when it comes to us, no one's getting charged. When it comes to us, no one's being convicted. When it comes to killing us, you can do it with impunity. Even if you do get charged, juries are saying not guilty because your life doesn't matter. And so that's the whole reason why we have to come down here and push back and say black lives matter. My generation is the generation of change. This is the